Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Lexia and it is a Saturday and I thought I would do an extra video for you guys. Um, I know it's like six days a week, but I mean, today is my day off. Um, yeah, um, I do have somewhere to go today, but I thought we could do a little get ready and just kind of have some fun. I got some things in the mail yesterday and I thought it'd be nice to share it with you guys. I mean, I didn't spend a whole lot. Um, no, I did get some stuff that I'm not going to show you because it's not really beauty related. I mean, so I got, um, there's a balloon stuck up in the fan. It's been up there forever. And I can't turn the lights on without it. And it's really dark in here today. <sighs> yeah, anyway. Okay, so I am going to, oh, I don't know what's going on with my hand, but it's like cramping such, so badly. Okay, so I did order something from Shoppers. Maybe actually I'll give this a try. I was going to use my girl in, but I think I want to try the Stila. I heard that Stila is actually going out of business. So, yeah, that kind of sucks. Um, I'm going to give this one a try. It says it's a concealer and foundation all day. So I did pick this up for Lucas. It was a sample. So usually you get three samples when you buy something that is uh, luxury from shoppers. But, uh, yeah, um, I bought some really hydrating cream for Lucas because yeah he's got some hydration um, issue my daughter just walked in and now she's like completely puzzled by it all I might just go turn off the light so um, I got these dashing diva ultra shine gel palette Wears just like salon gel, uh, lasts up to 14 days, 34 strips. Um, I have been having some issues with, with my nail polish staying on. So I'm going to give this a try like when she's probably sleeping. Can you turn off that light, Lucas? Okay, so it comes with like, excuse me. Dad, I need that on. You don't need it on. Oh, oh. <laughs> did, you, did you like watching the balloon go around? Was you, you balloon from her birthday party. So, yeah, I got. Can you say nails? Me. Yeah, th those are for mummy. So I'm gonna give these a try. Um, I've never tried them before. Yeah. So they come with a bunch of uh, items. Okay. Anyway, I thought I'd try them. Out this weekend, I will let you guys know how it goes wasn't expecting her to realize I was doing a visit video so so I got two of them um, they are $14 at shoppers um, there's only these two from dashing diva the rest are from quo and they're more Halloween colors I cannot get them locally I went to my Walmart I went to um, yeah so that's not going back in these are the second one those ones are super pretty so I'm excited to try them. I've found them on Wine and uh, on Instagram. Yeah. Okay. So anyway. Okay. So I did it another Elf order because I noticed that they come out with something new. So I was like, huh. Let's see. So they have putty blush. So I thought I'd grab it. So I did this one in the color Tahiti. No, you gonna get that one out? Okay. 
And Evelyn is going to show you my new cleansing cloud. A reusable soft makeup remover pad in both black and white that allows you to remove your makeup and with only water. This makeup remover wipes your face clean from all types of makeup with the need without the need to rub or scrub. A water assistant loosening your makeup while the technology of the fiber holds onto the makeup to, <laughs> to ensure it does not transfer back to your skin. The cleaning the cleansing cloud reaches deep into your pores to remove all impurities, allowing a clean and fresh face. So I'll give these a try, and I'm going to let you guys know how they work. Um, I think because I only spent $15, I didn't get a free gift. But I was running low on just... Can I see this, please? This is huge. The daily face cleanser so I'll probably be using this in the morning okay so Whoop. Oopsie doopsies. okay so let's get into some makeup I am going to use my ow I have Evelyn I'm going to use my It Cosmetics. Avalyn, please don't. Yes, I need that one. Okay, give me one and you can have the other one. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you a monkey? Are you going to go play monkey with Dad? Play with daddy. Oh, you're gonna be a monkey behind me. <coughs> so, this might be a little dark on me today, but you know what? No. Where did you, did you give the other one to daddy? I have a third pair. Where's the other? I don't know. You ran off with it yesterday, didn't you? You did. Here, I'm losing, daddy's got it. I'm a kid. Yeah. You can take that one. Go show Daddy how you put your foundation on. It's just absolutely crazy how pale I am. Okay, so I am going to put on my setting powder.
And I thought I would use the new palette I bought to give a, a bit of a review. I know you've, if you've uh, already bought this, then... Or you know you already seen maybe reviews on it when it came out, but you know what? It's kind of nice to do reviews on, especially when you buy them, because then you get to be honest, right? Like, I don't have to worry about saying it's good so that I can stay on somebody's PR. So, so I am using the It Cosmetics airbrush. Daddy can do that, honey. Daddy can do it. Yeah, yeah, Daddy. You could say, Dad, I'd like a new show. You go ask Daddy, please. Go ask Brady. No, you can go ask Daddy. She wants me to put on a show. Okay. So I just kind of give my eyelashes a bit of a curl. Um, just, okay, so get that all dusted off. I love using the It Cosmetics blush or um, concealing powder. The powder. Okay, so I am going to use the 35C Chic. Create some sort of monstrosity out of this. Okay, so there are the colors. I'll show you guys. Ooh, look at that. So, um, it's got some really nice greens. Um, there's no mirror in this, which, I mean, for a pan this big, Probably why it's a lot cheaper than other palettes of the same size. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with a nude tone, kind of. I am going to go in with this. Hold on one second here. I'm going to turn this over. Okay, so I used Chic It Out and then Call Me Gore. There are some really, really pretty shades that I'm going to have to try in here. And there's one really glitter one that I'm just going to stay away from because the last time I played with glitter, I had it on my face the next day. And sometimes the glitter is hard to wash away. There's a lot of fallout on this pan. I really like this pink though. It is super pretty. Easy to build up. Okay, so so there is my purple shade. I'm gonna go in just right to the crease. You can believe it, Lucas has today off. This is like the first Saturday all year he's had off besides COVID. So 
So I am going to take some of this stuck on you and I am going to And I'm going to go from the outside in. So I am using enamored. I don't know if I got any on oh, my brush. I've got like two mirrors set up now so that I could just kind of. Okay, so this is Heart Melts, which is a beautiful color. Kind of want to play with some of the greens in this because I don't do greens often. Oh, look at that. That's just a. I don't know why I'm putting my eye, line, eye like that. Whoa. That is a shade. I remember I got those. I was just seeing if it was. There's a soft pink in here. Yeah, this is the one I want to use. Okay. Not exactly done with that, but I am right now. I am going to take up close mirror. And I am going to use my beautiful pink eyeliner here. So I am going to take I think I'm going to take this purple So this is Playtime And I 
background is not working for me. I'm using it like a double eyeliner and then I'm going to smudge it out. Okay. I'm going to use my primer. the setter. Okay. So let's use this putty blush. Do you like how they had it like this instead of like this because then you can't see it the other way, right? So I am going to grab one of my sponges because I heard the sponges are the best way to go. So this is super creamy. So there it is there. I only grabbed one because I don't feel like I need to, to do the whole line, but that's me, right? Like, plus really, like... They're only, I think, I can't remember how much they are exactly, but, I mean, I don't need a bunch of blushes. This is not working. Sorry guys. I see it. I just it's nice that it's totally like it's very light.
I do like how it's like it's easily blendable that's for sure I think it just not put on too much but whatever all right so let me use comment today Although that looks darker than. I'm going to wash my brushes tomorrow. That should be fun. Oh, I didn't put on mascara. my wonder Okay, sorry about that. I just got a bit of the eyeliner somewhere else than I wanted to, so I just wanted to fix it without subjecting you guys to all of that. <laughs> um, I have no idea what kind of lip I even want to do today. Is there a new one that I haven't played with? Um, I do play this. What is this? So I think this is like a lip balm. Yes, it is. Hmm. Let's use this one. Charlotte Tilbury. Charlotte Tilbury. I have to say, I think I found my new favorite lipstick. This is Walk This Way. Walk On. Walk of No Shame, sorry. It was, I heard Aerosmith last night singing Walk This Way. So, of course, that just popped into my head. My hair is being all weird today. Okay, so here's the final look, guys. Like... What do you think? It's a really pretty palette. Like it's got some pretty colors, but it's crazy. Like you get one of these palettes and it feels like it could fill everything. It's got a little bit of all the different colors in there. It feels so good on the It's a pretty color, but I don't know. I don't know. It was a little hard to use. A little hard to use. Okay, guys, I wouldn't recommend this, I have to say. I hope you guys have a great day, and please don't forget to like, share, and make sure you're subscribed.